M0 FXP, let's program our radio using RT systems and the SD card that is in the head unit. First thing we need to do is hold down the F button and save to our SD card before we put it in the software. So there you are, it's highlighted in red. We'll push the channel change back up, uh, right to SD card, click all, turn the channel knob to the left so it highlights the red, click OK, and it's now writing the contents. This is needed for the files that are going to be inside your SD card. Right, once that's done, it will say completed. Let's go to our RT Systems software, which is about $25. Okay, let's get the SD card, put it into our PC. We've got the FTM300 RT Systems software fired up. It's about $25 to buy this. So when you put it in, you get this file come up in your USB flash drive because we're using a converter from uh, SD card to USB so we're just going to go communications and read data from SD card and it finds your FTM 300 click OK and there you are I've got many many memories you can add memories as usual just by typing the frequency 145.600 for example repeater you could use you can select digital mode and then one of the handy things you can go file uh, I've already done this, uh, go file, external data, repeater book, put in your location, select a couple of 2 meter and 70 we've got here, 30 mile radius, click OK, and look, you've got all your repeaters, and if you wanted to use them, just go create file, at the bottom there, so see that at the bottom, create file, it makes a new file, and now you can, if you select at the top number one, and hold your finger on the mouse and scroll down, you can go right click and you can either go control C or go copy go back to your original file because every time you read it opens up a new file well, let's just for practice sake go here click on 87 right click and then paste and look you've got all those repeaters and also you've got your APRS settings if you go and radio settings here go settings radio menu settings and look all your settings there for APRS Beaconing, group mode, DTMF, it's all here. Uh, so much you can do with this, uh, with this software, and it's so straightforward, it does most of the stuff for you. Anyway, once you've done that, and you've made your changes, then you just go File, uh, we've, uh, Write, Major Changes, Write Data to SD Card, click OK, and it does it. it you know, you don't, there's no message, it just does it. Now you can just take out your SD card, put it into your radio, I'll show you what to do, and hey presto, it's all working, so RT Systems, I recommend it, it's inexpensive, $25, you don't need a cable, They'll, it gets instantly delivered to you as soon as you pay, and you can copy and paste between different radios, and how good is that? So 7.3, thanks for watching my channel, catch you on air, all the best. We've programmed, all we do now is hold down F, again select SD card, back up, but this time we do read from SD card, all turn to the left and then OK and when that says completed you're all good to go and that's a, a very good way of doing things without having to use the expensive SCU cables that are required for programming. Bye for now, 7-3, all the best. Please remember to hit the like and subscribe to my channel.